All right, guys. Today we're going to be going over the garden closure clash, and this thing looks kind of complicated. It's hard to figure out at first, but I promise you, it's super easy once you know how to do it. So, we're gonna come to this side, and uh, you'll see that it's got this opening here. I'm gonna place down an immersive engineering barrel. We'll just tear this out so you can see, uh, and we're just gonna put a pipe here, and it connects right in. We'll take our immersive engineering hammer and turn the blue to orange. That means it's outputting. So, oops, I didn't mean to flip it. So we uh. Toss our water in here, and it'll start pumping the water automatically. You don't need any sort of special thing going on there. If you look here, it started to fill up with water. So that's the first part of it. Next, we want to get water, and we need some sort of seed, any seed will work. And if you're using cactus or something like that, you need uh, sand. So we're just going to go with the standard wheat. So you put your dirt here in the bottom, or sand, and you put your seeds right here. And if you noticed, the fertilizer thing went up and so did this so next to uh, get your to automate the uh, extraction of the seeds and uh, whatever product it's making wheat in this case out of here you want to place a chest or some sort of uh, piping that'll pull it out of here I'm not just gonna use a chest next we want to power this thing and it's done right from the top so it kind of lights up this light a little bit <coughs> See, it's got this cool little particle effect, but you'll see why I say it is so OP. As you can tell, it's going through the stages of wheat super fast. This thing is insane. So if you get something like I've got going on over there, and I'll show you that in another video. This is uh, a garden cloche infinite power source. But uh, anyways, that's all there is to this. It's pretty simple, and it is super OP. I highly suggest uh, trying one of these out in one of your worlds.